Hey guys, welcome to Choose Your Own Path. So, today, I think it's Tuesday. Let's go with that, it's Tuesday. So, as I'm going to tell you a little story before I start anything, uh, I have a good friend that uh, I've worked with for 30 years that I've been at the uh, hospital. I uh, worked in the same departments with him. We worked in a housekeeping department. Now, he's an older gentleman, he's in his 60s, I guess. And I've been telling him, like, dude, you're old, retire, before you die or something like that, and whatever. And he's like, yeah, 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 I will, I will, I will. Well, he's not dead. But he's retiring. And he ended up getting sick. And now he's in the hospital. He's not a worker anymore, now he's a patient. Good friend of mine, really good friend. Uh, nice guy. Give him that. <laughs> it's not bad. But, um... I went and visited him today, because I work there, obviously, so I can do that. And he had a couple of frogs uh, that were, sorry, let's play. Uh, a couple of frogs carved out of uh, stone sitting there. And he says to me, he says, Richard, I, he says, I love frogs. I love frogs. Can you make me something? And I said, yes, I can. So today, we are going to carve him a frog sitting on a leaf. I don't know if you can see that, but there's a eye there, there's an eye there, there's his mouth. Anyway, he put him on a leaf kind of thing. Maybe a butterfly up here will carve separately, plat him on there. And then I was thinking of another frog to kind of hide in there. Something like this. I might put him down here. Hands on. Down here kind of thing. We'll see. Let's start off with the first frog. So um, that's all I can tell you about that. Uh, this time I'm going to bring you along for the ride. So, what we're going to do is put you on the overhead camera. Bring you down. You're going to have to shut off or turn the fan around. <coughs> way too, way too crazy. And what we're using today will be one of our cut saw bits. We're gonna go with this guy, he's a tapered bit. You can check out the uh, descriptions below. Go to uh, cut saw and I'll, I'll send you the link. And uh, you can save yourself like 5%. I use them, why can't you? So we're gonna go ahead and turn on the vacuum and go from there. You got the frog outline. Uh, we can take away all of the outside. You can sort of see the frog in there now. We'll take out all the outside and work on maybe a little bit of the leaf. Okay, so a lot of the dust out. We're gonna have to change up our bit and we're going to use the bigger cuts all for this job. Right? There we go. is a bit out but we're gonna bring it around so this bit is too thick we go back to this guy yeah. I don't trust this machine anymore
once you pull out your, your your frog out of there, you just gotta work around it to try to pull them out. You know, deep a little, little digger. If you've got enough wood, go for it. And then we'll keep on working on that. All right, so let's keep on going here. So we got the frog out, and we're gonna turn this back. Okay, so we got the frog coming out. We got the leaf he's gonna be sitting on. We're just gonna dig out a little bit more of this. And then we also have to round the frog out and then get in the back somehow a little bit more of an angle. Maybe take up a li little bit of this out. And his eye has to be pushed back because he's looking the other way. We'll figure that out too. So, so far, I'm okay. I'm happy with it. So, oh. Okay, so we got our frog out. I think we have him out, sitting on a leaf, a little big branch, and uh, yeah, so I think I'm happy with that. So the next step would be to sand it. So I don't know if you guys can see that guy, but he's in there. I like him. You like him? I like him. All right, so sanding, painting, and epoxy. And then maybe a butterfly here. I don't know. I'm not sure. I'm not sure yet. I'll figure it out. All right? All right, stay tuned.